So, eleventh uh, class, uh, we are starting the new concept that is strings. Okay. वो भी कर लेते हैं. Don't worry. Our today's concept is strings, right? Now, as the basic meaning of string already known to you, string means collection of characters. String is collection of characters, right? Like this is string. This is string. This is character. Single character. This is string. Enclosed in single or double quotes. But this is wrong. Starting with single quote and closing with double quotes. This is invalid. Then vice versa case. Starting from double, closing with single. This is also invalid. Right? So string is a data type in Python where you can enter the combination of letters and numbers, or only alphabets or only numbers enclosed in double quotes or single quote. This is also string. AD one two three four. This is considered to be the string. Draw. Focus here. Okay. Am I clear? Online class. The general meaning of string. Now suppose uh, I have S equal to Mumbai. Okay, and I say print s. I say print s. I just save here string one. So Mumbai gets print. Mumbai gets print. Okay. Sir, if I have s for double quotes, then I will get print here. So s print will become. That will be S. I have assigned my value Mumbai to a variable S. So S is of type string. Okay. Yes. You can check the type here. You can check the type of variable over here. Class str. Okay, what is the role of type function? Type function will specify the data type of the variable. That variable is having value of which type? Right now, the s variable is holding the value of string type. So, s variable is of type string. Okay. On the contrary, I say x equal to twelve, and I say print type x. X is holding the value of type integer. So how? Acha. In case you get this as MCQ. how to check the how it will be displayed angle bracket class single quotes ke andar data type ka naam the name of data type enclosed in single quotes this is the format am i clear to everyone online class up till here am i clear to everyone any doubt any queries yes any questions you want to ask all right now in or you can find the length of your string by using the len function see here 
right suppose i am having variable y equal to len s the len function stands for length function it will calculate the total length of the string the total length of the string and the length is always in numeric form so i have assigned the calculated length in a variable y and i am going to print y right six the length of string mumbai is six now see here i take another string s1 equal to mumbai space city mumbai space city space is also considered as one character so space will also be counted over here you know you can take special characters also inside the string right so space is also considered as one of the character so now according to it what will be the length of string Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Check it. Am I clear to everyone? Yes, sir. Any doubt? Any doubt? All right. Now see here carefully one more thing. Uh, up till now. you people have i just change the code over here uh i'm giving the string punjab bete up till now you all have studied the for loop with range function check out this loop all of you see the lcd offline class carefully observe the lcd first then you practice on your pc here i have not taken the range function online class you also please pay attention i have not taken the range function arshdeep focus should be only on lcd x in s when you take in after that in this particular variable name it resembles a sequence the sequence can be string or list or tuple list and tuple we have not done till now so i am having example here of string now what it means x will be referring to each and every individual character of string if i write here print x print x what will be the first value of x p p okay see x in s x is referring to each value of string s starting from p starting from p got it any doubt up till here 
okay now i write here hyphen now see after every individual letter of the string individual character of the string hyphen has been displayed hyphen has been displayed now one very interesting thing i am going to tell you about string then i will start short short mental ability questions that can cover your mcq portion right so all of you lcd please see the lcd bete uh, in the last lecture we discuss about indexing that starts from zero and goes till n minus 1 bete one concept is forward indexing what i mean by this zero one oh oh two three four five p u n j a and b i just set it again okay this is forward indexing in the positive way whenever you have forward indexing it goes in positive direction starting from 0 to n minus 1 1 we have backward indexing it always starts from the last character and starts with the position minus 1 okay check it out all of you check it out what is index 2 equivalent to what What is indexing five equivalent to minus one? So from here, from this diagram, the concept is clear that forward indexing starts from zero and goes till n minus one, but backward indexing starts from minus one, from the last character. Forward starts from the first character. Backward starts from the last character. forward is in positive counting backward is in negative counting online class up till here am i clear to all gursirat diya himanshu is the concept clear up till here to all of you all right now being 11th class non medical child you are very much expert in english also this child is entering the class so late <laughs> recording is there with it what do you mean by the word slice raise your hand for the answer don't give mass answering all the time jap jot what are your views about the word slice slice maybe a piece of uh, piece what you call it the tukda कुछ अंश कुछ पोर्शन आई वॉन्ट टू हैव अ स्लाइस ऑफ दिस केक अ पीस ऑफ दिस केक फ्रॉम द बिगर साइज केक जस्ट आई नीड अ स्लाइस 
I need a piece. Similar is string slice. When you pick up some portion from your string, when you pick up some portion from your string, that is called string slicing. Okay? Clear? Another important concept which you must be aware about string. We can perform two major operations on string. First operation is concatenation. Second operation is replication. Oh, sorry. Replication. Concatenation operation is performed by plus symbol. Replication operation is performed by the asterisk, the multiply symbol. When we use the plus sign, like I say, two plus three, when plus sign is used on numbers, it will generate a third number. Right? When plus symbol is operated, Gurjot, your focus is more on PC than less on my lecture. When you perform addition on two numeric numbers, the result is always the third number. But when you perform addition on two individual strings, it will concatenate them, it will join them, and it will become one string एक बात हमेशा याद रखना स्ट्रिंग के साथ आप कभी भी कोई इंटीजर ऐड नहीं कर सकते लाइक सपोज आई हैव अ स्ट्रिंग हियर आई शो यू दिस स्मॉल प्रोग्राम प्रिंट एस प्लस टू यू कैन नॉट ऐड एनी इंटीजर विद स्ट्रिंग ओके can only concatenate string to integer. You cannot add any numeric number to integer. Okay? Now see here. Punjab is a city. One string is S, Punjab. Another string is S1 is a city. Now I say S plus S1. S plus S1. Now what will happen? It will join the two strings together. Punjab is a city will be joined together. Check it out. There will be no space that we have to set. Punjab is a city. Okay. I know it is wrong grammatically. Punjab is a state. Okay. So uh, let us make it state. Okay. Right. Punjab is a state. Okay. Now see carefully. If you want to give space, you have two options. Either give space after the last letter of the first string or specify space before the first character of the second string. Now check it out.
you want to say this yes. got it clear now comes the so from here you make out that plus symbol which performs the addition on whole numbers performs concatenation operation on string by concatenation we mean joining of two individual strings you're not well not feeling well you're okay sure you want to have water you can go and uh, fresh yourself go oh, better pani mani piyo arshdeep please be quiet don't disturb the class okay now comes the second operation replication replication means the number of times the string will be repeated see here s into 3 in replication one para one operand is string second operand must be integer but in concatenation both the expression must be string now this replication performed by multiply symbol it won't multiply like other number 2 into 3 6 it will repeat the string number of times you have mentioned check it out punjab 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 okay punjab punjab and punjab clear any doubt any queries up till here all of you you can't replicate two strings together in order to perform replication one operand must be string other must be integer other must be integer all right tell me the answer of this पंजाब पंजाब के बाद स्पेस दी हुई है मैंने सेवन सेवन एंड सेवन फोर्टीन वाई थ्री आई हैव गिवन टू फोर्टीन क्लियर ऑनलाइन क्लास लेक्चर इज क्लियर Any doubt? Any queries? Now comes the concept of string slicing. Please shut the door. Consider this string. Casa Blanca. Okay. what i mean by string slice print how to give the string slice the name of the string japan jot see here the name of the string opening square bracket starting index colon ending index bracket closes this close. now what will happen slice means one piece from the given original string you are picking up some portion some piece lower limit is included upper limit is not included it is always one less than the upper limit for achieving the answers मेक द इंडेक्सिंग फर्स्ट कैसा प्लांका स्ट्रिंग की पहले इंडेक्सिंग कर लो 
जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन नाउ स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम टू दैट मीन्स एस एस ए बी एल ए सेवन पे है एन सेवन इज नॉट इंक्लूडेड सेवन इज नॉट इंक्लूडेड राइट एम आई क्लियर टू ऑल ऑफ यू क्लियर अप टिल हेयर ऑल राइट जीरो कोलन सेवन स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम सी ए एस ए बी एल ए कैसा ब्ला कैसा ब्ला ऑल राइट आई ओमिट द हायर लिमिट आई ओमिट द हायर लिमिट जब्बन जोत focus on lcd i have omit the upper limit now when upper limit is not given whatever lower limit has been given starting from that lower limit by default it goes till end of the string when upper limit is not given by default it will go till the end of the string all right reverse of this case lower limit is not given but upper limit is given when lower limit is not given by default it starts from zero kasab yes diya himanshu gursirat lecture is clear Okay. All right. Uh, let me give one negative indexing. Minus one colon minus four. Minus one colon minus four. <laughs> Nothing will come. <laughs> okay, whenever you are having the negative index and you are confused about it, you want to know the positive index. Add length to it. Add length to the negative index. You will get the positive index. So it comes. It comes. Nine, nine minus one plus nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine आ गया ना? Colon six. So it is not a valid range. That is why no output was there. That is why no output was there. Okay. माइनस फोर कोलन माइनस वन नाउ चेक नाउ चेक माइनस फोर में टेन ऐड करो सिक्स माइनस वन में टेन ऐड करो नाइन ए एन सी क्लियर है दिस इज स्लाइस बेटे स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द लोअर इंडेक्स स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हेयर फ्रॉम द गिवन ओरिजिनल स्ट्रिंग वी आर टू पिक अप द स्लाइस दैट इज रेफर्ड बाय लोअर लिमिट टू अपर लिमिट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द लोअर गो टिल अपर बट अपर रेंज इज नॉट इंक्लूडेड इट इज एन माइनस वन लाइक फॉर एग्जाम्पल अगेन आई से थ्री कोलन सिक्स स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम जीरो 
zero, one, two, three. This is three. Start from A. Go till six minus one. It will be A B L. A B L. Clear? Am I clear? Yes, online class, things are clear.